Hi, I'm Mel and I am Double Pisces Tarot and today I'm doing a reading for Aries. So let's get started. Asking for guidance from the divine, from Isis, from our ancestors, aunties, uncles, grandparents, great grandparents, my father and the angels sending unconditional love always. Guidance for Aries. Father, Son, Holy, Spirit, Guidance for Aries, please, spirits. Guidance for Aries. <clears throat> We've got Privileged Woman lady privileged lady family room and marriage on the back of the deck we've got community So this could involve some kind of feminine energy. This could be your energy. You could be in this energy, someone close to home, um, some kind of commitment. So let's see what comes out. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Spirits, what is this privileged lady for Aries? Privileged lady for Aries. Let me just take that one. So we have the Eight of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. So this could have something to do Virgo energy, the magician on the back of the deck. So this could have something to do with some kind of privileged lady in your life, some kind of woman that's close to home. Looks like some type of argument, maybe some kind of conflict with this woman. What is this family room for Aries, please, spirits? The moon, Pisces, Cancer energy. One card, please, spirits. The sun on the back of the deck. So this family room could mean something close to home. Your family, your home.
Maybe it's about taking a certain path that's close to home. You may be feeling closed off at the moment about the decision, but taking the moon, the moon path is the path you're supposed to take. It may be dark and you may not know what's ahead, but it's the right way. May lead you to the sun. <clears throat> okay, what is this marriage for Aries? What is this marriage for Aries? on the back of the deck so this marriage could be some kind of commitment some kind of commitment between two people look at that two of cups and marriage this could do with a virgo the hermit's coming out or someone that's in hermit mode when i look at this card I look at the cat panther thing that's on it. Maybe that animal comes out to you, some kind of cat. Could be Oh, there's you, Aries, Aries energy. It's obviously someone close to home. Okay, so now we've done that. So there is some kind of female feminine energy that's in your life at the moment that's close to home that you're having some kind of arguments with about some kind of family something close to home to you about taking a path that you're closed off about about a commitment Okay, so we're going to use the NYX Oracle cards, which are designed by Lily Cat Tarot, and see what NYX has to say for you. Or say to you, we'll get two cards. You're being protected. Two cards, please. Spirits for Aries. Two cards for Aries. A cycle has ended, another begins. A price is to be paid. Some answers only come through dreams and smile, but remember. On the back of the deck, the hard part will soon be over. Okay. Oops. Okay, so I'll put that there. I'll get some clarifiers out and we'll see what these mean. Okay. 
his card. I did pre shuffle. cycle has ended another begins the ace of wands so wands is energy new energy new creativity something new in your life some kind of new creativity inspiration energy is starting in your life another cycle well another begins a price is to be paid for Aries. A price is to be paid. A price is to be paid. The Nine of Cups is normally like wish fulfillment, but it can also mean um, drinking. So maybe a price to be paid for indulging and being closed off. Some answers only come through dreams. What is this for Aries? You are Aries, you are Aries energy. This is the Emperor, he is Aries energy. So, the answers you seek are through your dreams and you know this. And then you will make a decision. Smile but remember for Aries, smile but remember. The King of Wands. So, so when you look at this King of Wands, he looks really stern and angry. Wands is fire energy, so Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. So he looks like he knows what's going on. So always keep your guard up. Page of Swords, is someone watching? Okay, so now we've done that. It looks like that there's some feminine em energy that's coming in um, or is in your energy that may be coming in about a situation you've been closed off about. Okay, so now we're going to do... But yes, as I was saying, the answers are through dreams. And karma is always a thing, maybe. So always watch what you do. Um, always do good things and get good things back always do bad things and get bad things back um, but there's some kind of cycle starting some kind of new beginning happening um, but yes never forget the past also so yeah there's a few messages coming out today for you which is really good um, so yes now as I was saying we will now use the intuitive music messages oracle which is designed by myself um, I will draw two cards for you today. When the reading is done, um, put on your headphones and listen to these songs. They will have messages for you in them. 
So let's get to it. Sun, Holy Spirit. Two cards for Aries, please, spirits. Two cards for Aries. Don't throw your love away, the searches. He wasn't man enough, Tony Braxton. Love really hurts without you, Billy Ocean. And on the back, hold on, Wilson Phillips. So, yes, as I said, when this reading is done, put these songs on. They will have messages for you in them. Thank you for coming to my reading. Um, I have a lot of Aries energy around me um, with family, and I have Aries in Venus in my chart. So I hope to connect with the Aries. Um, so I hope these messages help out for today. I hope to see you again. Thank you for coming to my reading. Bye-bye.